Okay, Bill, thank you. October marks the 20th anniversary of the disappearance of Crystal Marler in McCrary County. The 15-year-old's remains were found in 2009, but her killer remains unknown. LEX 18's Michael Burke has more from Whitley City. 20 years later, and not a day goes by when Lorella Wood doesn't think about Crystal Marler. There's always something to remind you of her. She was at my house a lot. Marler was a half-sibling to Wood's grandson. She disappeared in 1998, and it wasn't until 11 years later when skeletal remains were located in McCreary County, officials were able to rule her death a homicide. The case remains open, remains unsolved. They are somebody out there that, that knows what, what happened. We just hope that they come forward sometime or another and, and let this family have some peace. And after all this time, it's been two decades, all of the leads have dried up, dwindling down to just rumors and gossip. But the sheriff did say that no piece of information will be considered insignificant. Because you never know what that may lead to. For someone like Lorella Wood, the hope is it leads to finding those responsible. That might even be more meaningful than a conviction at this point. Just a sad not knowing why they would do something like that. It hurts. And the pain remains just as fresh as it was during the fall of 1998. You don't get over a death, but something like that, it's a lot worse. Covering the news in McCreary County, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News. If you have any information about the death of Crystal Marler, you're asked to call the McCreary County Sheriff's Office. That number is 606-376-2322.